Hi guys, welcome back to another vlog. It's Christmas Eve. I'm finished work for the day, hallelujah. I finished like two-ish, back at two. For Christmas, um, I am not now not back until 6th of January, so I am buzzed about that. I can't wait for a little bit of time off. So yeah, it's Christmas Eve and it's been snowing. So I'm gonna go and take puppy out for a walk for his first time in the snow. He's obviously, he's still a puppy and this is his first winter, so it's the first snow he's gonna see. Uh, the snow came just in time for Christmas, which is lovely. It feels, I think up until today, I hadn't felt Christmassy and I think the snow has helped a little bit. Um, I've tried to put Christmas jumpers on all week and things like that, but it just wasn't feeling Christmassy this year. But I think the snow and going out in the snow was gonna help a lot with that. I've got my new cozy coat on, which I love. This is from New Look. It was like 30 pounds or something. Really affordable and snuggly, so I'm ready. I'm gonna go walk the dog and then I'll uh, catch up with you guys later. Oh, Christmas tree. Oh, Christmas tree. Just what you mean to me Oh, Christmas tree Honestly, it's never been much about you Don't get me wrong, I think you're great Just back from my little walk with Casper, that was so nice. He loves the snow, it's so sweet. He will just run about happy as laddie, get soaking wet and eat the snow. Fabulous. So yeah, that was a nice little, a nice little way to spend a Christmas Eve. It's like half four now. So I think I'm just gonna go sit downstairs, chill, maybe have a glass of gin. What do you guys do on Christmas Eve? Usually I'll either go out for food or um, we used to go to the theatre quite often or the cinema. Obviously can't do all that sort of stuff at the moment. Last year I went out for a couple of drinks, but again, can't do that at the moment. I don't know what to do with myself, um, so I'll probably just sit downstairs with the family and just and just chill. Every Christmas Eve, me and my sister get to open our pyjamas. That is tradition in our house, so that is definitely gonna happen tonight. And then we get to go to bed and wake up in our Christmas pyjamas, which is always lovely. We're gonna have a hot chocolate with Bailey's tonight. I'll probably speak to you guys next on Christmas Day, or I'll maybe show you my Christmas pyjamas, but probably next on Christmas Day. Yeah, I hope you have a great day and enjoy it the best you can under the circumstances. Yeah, have a good one, guys. We've got the Christmas pyjamas. So this is the set this year. It's a lovely little Jack Will set. Usually my mum gets us like actual Christmas pyjamas, but she said she couldn't find any this year. But I think I prefer these because I think all my pyjamas I own are Christmassy. So it's nice to have a normal pair. Very comfy as well. You could definitely lounge about the house in this on Boxing Day and um, eat all the leftover food. Then we got this like, you know how the shackets, shirt jacket things are in at the moment? We have a pajama one, which is like teddy fleece sort of, it's not quite as much as a teddy fleece, fleece sort of jacket that I can chuck on. And it's kind of like a dressing gown meets shirt and um, I'm very much here for it. Root of tradition we celebrate More than anything, it's all the people around you. Merry Christmas, guys! I hope you're having a great day. I am already. I'm wearing my new outfits. Very, very festive. I picked this up from, it was Next actually. I got it with my Aberdeen Inspired voucher, which you'll have seen in the last video. I thought I'd wear this festive little number. It's gonna be so comfy as well because it's that crepe sort of stuff and very stretchy, so winning. I'm gonna go get my doggy now. I'm gonna let him open his presents. Yeah, we'll go in front of the tree, that festive. Yeah, it's been a good morning so far. A mimosa, open some the stocking. I still get a stocking, but I love it. And yeah, so far doing so good. I hope you're having a great day and I'll check in with you guys later. My sister's here. My cousins too. My brothers flew in this afternoon. We're catching up. Oh, what a year. Uh, oh, Christmas tree, I nearly missed you there.
guys happy boxing day i hope you had a great day yesterday i know i certainly did we had a great day filled with immediate family and lots of good food lots of presents um probably too much presents actually we were very much spoiled this year it was a great way to spend the day so i hope you had a great time and had the best time you can under the circumstances the best time with the best people casper had a great time yesterday he was in his element he had presents he had food he had lots of company all day he's like what's going on and he was buzzing the whole day it was so sweet i'll pop in some of it the pictures i took with him on the day i love them so much i'm gonna get them printed off for a frame for my bedroom i think um because they're adorable but yeah he's getting so grown up now like he's lost his baby face completely he looks like an adult but yeah he's coming around again today and he'll get the rest of his presents and he'll maybe get his christmas dinner yeah excited thought i'd jump on and show you one of my christmas presents so it was this curler the wave sort of curlers very molly may so i'm waiting hopefully release my uh, inner molly may that's not gonna happen but we're gonna give it a go this is not actually the beauty works one this is just one off of amazon so fingers crossed it goes well but yeah i'm gonna put you a little time lapse and you can just watch me get ready i suppose without the joy that surrounds you For a first attempt, it's, it's. I think it's okay. I think I've got some work to do around the crown of the head um, to make it look a little bit less frizzy, but pop a clip in or something, it looks okay. Yeah, I'll take it. I'm not mad at that. Just what you mean to me. Oh, Christmas tree. Honestly, it's never been much of. around you oh, it's actually been a little while since i spoke to you guys i've had a few days off filming it's been quite nice to just sort of take in some of the time and to be fair i've not actually done that much and over the past few days you know that in between period of christmas and new year where you don't really do much um you maybe see a few people which we can't really do we can go out for walks and stuff but that's kind of like kind of like it like yesterday i saw holly and we went to drive through costa and sat in our cars like separate cars and open Christmas presents, which yeah, that's as exciting as it gets at the moment. But it's actually Hogmanay now. So it has been, I think I last spoke to you on Boxing Day. So it has been a few days. It's, it's New Year's Eve and um, I've done my makeup. So we've got some glittery, some glittery eyes. I thought, you know, I'd make somewhat of an effort. Red lip, feeling, feeling, you know, this is, this is the kind of style I'd go for if I was going out with my friends. We've done my Molly Mae curls, which I am living for at the moment. I think I'm getting slightly better at it. I mean, I, I did this hours ago, so it's starting to fall out now, so it might touch it up in little places and give myself a little bit of a powder, but we're fine. I'm, I'm trying to decide what to wear because right now I'm just in a t-shirt and jeans and when you're sitting in your house all night, can I really be bothered putting on something nice to see in the bells? I don't know. We're having an Indian tonight, so it's gonna be my family and my sister's boyfriend. Some drinks, um, I think there's been a quiz created. So I think we'll do a quiz party the night away. Yeah, I'm quite excited for it. I just don't know what to wear. I had an outfit planned and I should have put it on earlier because now I've just taken laziness and I don't really want to waste the outfit, you know? But then like, when else am I realistically gonna wear it? Because we can't do anything for weeks. So there's nowhere to actually wear this outfit out. Do I wear it tonight and get the use of it? Even though it's like literally just a pair of black leather look trousers and a white top, which I will get so much use out of. But you know, when I bought it, especially for today, I should probably wear it. But um, yeah, so we'll see what happens there. If I, sh if I do change, I'll show you what I wear. I hope you guys are having a good little Christmas break. Um, if you are off at the moment, obviously some people aren't off. I never used to have Christmas. I'm off at Christmas. I used to work in hospitality. So I always used to work clothes on Christmas Eve. Um, so I used to work till like 11, 12 at night. And then I was back in at 7 a.m. on Boxing Day. So I only ever had like my Christmas day and that was me. Yeah, it's been quite, it is nice to have some time off so i hope you're enjoying it if you are and i hope that things are hopefully a more positive 
2021. Better 2021. All our fingers are crossed. Hopefully, hopefully 2021 is a better year for everyone. To be fair, this will probably be the last I speak to you before 2021 and I'll probably end this vlog here as well. So I'll probably just, you know, close it off now and then I'll start afresh from tomorrow, which I am going to be doing veganuary. But I'm going vegan for the month, or at least I'm going to try my best to. I've always sort of dipped my toe in, like I always uh, drink soya milk, I, you know, I use tofu when I can, like things like that. Like I do try my best. I don't really eat much meat. But for me, I think it'll be the cheese. Um, and just like hidden ingredients like I don't really know what some of the like things that you get caught out with are so things like that I'm not gonna penalize myself for it if I do eat it by mistake no I'm, I'm trying my best it is a learning curve we're gonna see how I get on for the month and then maybe gradually like if I find a good cheese like I can introduce that into my diet for the rest of the year sort of thing a little changes are the best so tomorrow we're actually gonna be having fajitas for our new year's meal and I'm gonna be making a mixed bean fajita for myself because um, they're having chicken so I'll have have mixed bean. I was gonna have corn. Corn pieces I have aren't vegan so I'm gonna have a mixed bean fajita which I'm very excited about. Yeah I'm gonna take you along on the journey. I'll probably incorporate meals and things into the weekly vlogs and um, vegan week one sort of thing. I'm gonna leave it there. Thank you so much for watching guys. I hope you have a lovely Christmas and New Year under these weird circumstances. I uh, hope it has been as good as you could have made it and here's to a better 2021. Bye guys. Oh Christmas tree Christmas tree Been wondering just what you mean to me Oh, Christmas tree Honestly, it's never been much about you Don't get me wrong, I think you're great Root of tradition, we Celebrate, but oh, Christmas tree more than anything.